I'm a mom. Of course I have a million things to do. I'm a mom. Of course I look like I have it together when I really don't. But that doesn't mean I can't look like I do. Hey there everyone, my name is Crystal and welcome to my fashion and lifestyle channel. If you were not new, then welcome back girl. So in today's video, it's another Pinterest inspired video and today's focus is going to be on rich mom outfits. The rich mom aesthetic. I've been seeing this trend pop up. I think it's more so on TikTok because that's where a lot of these trends originate. And I just thought it would be something fun. I think it kind of derives from like the old money and the quiet luxury. So we have the rich mom. And the emphasis behind the rich mom aesthetic is she looks like she's put together. She's classic. She's sophisticated. But she's comfortable. Comfort is key with this particular aesthetic. So it's just the, the mom that's on the go. The mom that's got a million errands to run. But she still wants to look good. So that's what it's about. You just just because you're a mom doesn't mean you can't walk around here looking stylish and classy and sophisticated girl like no uh-uh these kids we gotta take care of them but we can look good doing it so i'm gonna share with you guys some pinterest recreations that i just love and so i feel like anybody can recreate these looks so yeah without any further ado let's get into the looks all right and here is outfit number one and i kind of switched it up a little bit with my look um compared to the inspo pick and speaking of the inspo pick i will pop it on the screen now so i saw this look and absolutely loved it she just looks like a chic sophisticated mom this is something that i would wear i don't know this is something that i would wear like if i was with my kids to like go out to eat to dinner or something if we we're going out as a family and my kids are with me um then this is an outfit that i would wear so yeah i love the inspo pick so this is my recreation so starting from the top i have on my prada glasses because you can't look chic and sophisticated without some dark black frame sunglasses so these are mine hers are circular but mine are kind of like i don't know like a hexagon kind of a shape and so yeah so these are by prada and then she has on some pearls because you know you gotta have your pearls right so these are mine that i just recently got from zara um then i have on just a black cardigan i think in the inspo pic she has on like a black shirt or something i can't really tell because it's hard to really see when someone's wearing black in a picture but um it's like a black like kind of like quarter quarter length um top so i just rolled up the sleeves with this little cardigan and i think i got this from amazon and then she has a red bag i think hers is like her hermes bag i want my little coach bag that um i love i don't wear it hardly enough but i'm um, just to kind of go with the red because i love like the pop of red because it is an all black look and then she has on looks like some cropped black trousers um i have some black trousers but they're not cropped um but i didn't want to wear any trousers i wanted to wear a skirt because like i said i would probably go out to eat with my kids as a family and you know with this outfit so just wanted something a little bit dressier so i went with this denim skirt um that i got from boohoo i think i can't remember but it's it's old at this point and then she has on some white loafers and i hardly ever wear these loafers i've had them for a few years so this was a perfect time for me to style up some pieces that i hardly ever wear so these are some white loafers i don't even remember where i got them from but they have like a chain detail on the toe part on the top so love that and then she accessorized again with like a little cuff hers is silver so i just went with gold because i have mostly gold in this outfit so but yeah i love this outfit like i said this is a mom that's going out uh, maybe to out to eat dinner this is something that i'll wear if i'm out to eat with my kids i'm gonna try to like give you guys scenarios of where i wear these particular outfits when i'm with my kids and by the way my kids when i say my kids my kids are 17 and 11 so i have older kids but um still um i feel like you know you still want to be comfortable regardless of how old your kids are so um but this is the first look you guys let me know what you think about my recreation of the inspo pick and we will get into the next one all right, here is the next recreation, and I love this outfit as well. Um, in the inspo pic, she has on pretty much the exact t pieces that I have on. I pretty much did copy and paste with this look because I loved it so much, and it's just totally my style. And actually, I wore a variation to this uh, of this outfit just recently. So, you know, I'm all about outfit formulas. When I like an outfit formula, I tend to just repeat it because I know it works for me. So, but yeah, I love her outfit. Um, I changed up mine a little bit. Hers is more of a dressier type of look. Um, I kind of went a little bit more casual with my outfit. So um, starting from the top, I added some earrings. I think she has earrings, but hers are silver. So of course I love gold. I'm a gold girl. I'm a golden girl. <laughs> so I added these little like antique looking um, earrings. They're like vintage vibes. I got these from Commence. I absolutely love these earrings or earrings like this. They just give off classy and sophistication and just, 
yeah they just give off vintage vintage vibes so i love these um and then i just draped over a little cardigan that i got from target um and then i have on this linen blend shirt that's why it looks so wrinkly because it is linen um like i said i wanted to go with more of a casual type of vibe hers is more of a dressier type of top but mine is linen so it's more casual so that's pretty much how I wear this outfit. Um, so yeah, so this is old from H&M. And then she has on some white jeans. I put on my white wide leg jeans. Um, they are a little wrinkled too. Y'all don't mind that. Don't mind the wrinkledness. Um, but anyway, so these are... I don't know where they're from. I think they're from Boohoo. Don't quote me on that. But anyway, um, I have on my white jeans. And then she has on a red, looks like Jacquemus bag. Um, I didn't have anything like, or didn't have a bag like that. So I just went with this little red little bag, um, that I got from the thrift store. So this is thrifted just to go with the red. And then she has on some, this is like heels. I can't tell. Um, but they look like some sling back heels and they are gorgeous. I have some red like block heels, but like I said, I wanted to go with more of a casual look with this. So I went with just some red Mary Jane style ballet flats that I got from Kosh just recently. Love these. They were super comfortable. So I just kind of went with more of a casual kind of a vibe with this look. So, um, but this look, so as far as where I would wear this to, like I said, I just wore a variation of this outfit to my daughter's um, performing arts um, showcase. She is an aspiring actress. So y'all pray for her. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, she uh, did a skit um, this this particular night, and I wore something like this. So, if she, when she has another one, because I'm sure she's gonna have several, then this is something that I would wear to um, like her performing arts um, showcase. So yeah, this is a perfect outfit to wear to your kids' school if they're having some sort of event, like you know, like a performing arts showcase or some sort of band. They're in the band, and they have like a band showcase. Or if you want to meet your kids' teachers, then I feel like this will be a cute outfit. It lets them know you mean business. Lets them know that you care about yourself if you like you care about yourself then they're gonna assume that you care about your kids so i mean just the fact that, sh that you're showing up is enough but sometimes i like to do go a little extra mile to let them know you know you're not just messing with some any old mom you know so um but i love this outfit like i said it's just something really cute and sophisticated and i love the pops of red it just red is like a power color and i love to wear it and it's my favorite color so but i love this outfit i love my recreation of the look it's pretty much copy and paste but like i said i love the outfit so if i love it enough i'm gonna copy it like i really have to love it in order to copy it you know verbatim um because typically y'all know i like to put my own spin on it but this one i just went copy paste because i loved it so much so um but you guys let me know what you think about my recreation of the look and we'll get into the next one all right, and here is the next look. And when I saw the inspo pic, my heart melted. I love to see moms with their babies. And this is just like the cutest picture of a mom and her baby. And they are just at the beach, just enjoying each other. And I just thought this was just so sweet, right? Um, Mother's Day is coming up. So that's why I'm kind of doing the, these outfits um, because of Mother's Day is coming up. So in case you need like some outfit ideas also for Mother's Day, then this is dual purpose for that as well. So, um, but she just has on like a crochet top. It looks like and then some linen trousers and that's it like she's comfortable but somehow she still just looks sophisticated right she still looks sophisticated she has on some earrings i forgot to put on some earrings but yeah she still looks classy and chic even with just those you know two pieces so i mean in the summertime spring and summertime we're not going to be having a lot of clothes anyway right so um but this is my recreation of the look um i would wear something like this just like this mom in this picture i wear something like this to uh, on a beach trip and actually i wore something similar to this um with my kids when we went to uh the beach for spring break i actually wore these linen pants so um but um sorry from the top i have on some sunglasses these are my gucci sunglasses um and they're like in a tortoise shell just to kind of go with the brown theme of this outfit my top is like a crochet top these are going to be huge and popular trendy for the spring and summer season as they always are so this one in particular is from dish i love it i have it in another color as well um and then this mom probably has a little baby bag somewhere by her um i don't have babies so i don't need quite that big of a bag to carry around so i just went with a crossbody bag because that's kind of like my bag of choice when i'm with my kids is just a crossbody bag because just because it's easy hands-free i'm not having to fuss with having to hold a bag and sitting it down and forgetting that i set the bag down 
y'all know how it is so crossbody is my go-to um so yeah this one is from zara i just recently got it it's like in this kind of raffia kind of detail it actually comes with a smaller strap so that i can wear it like um like a shoulder bag or wear it like on the crook of my arm but again like i said i like crossbody so this is perfect for um this particular outfit and then i have on my um linen blend trousers these are from i think abercrombie i have these in i want to say three other colors i have them in a blue black and white so these are my go-to's are going to be my go-to for the spring and summer season like they're flowy just perfect so um but yeah so these are from abercrombie i think they still have these on the site and then my shoes she doesn't have any shoes on but if i was to be out then this is what i would wear and these are like an Hermes dupe i got these last year from belk um i got these in like two other colors and you guys when i showed these last i think last summer i showed these and you guys went crazy and bought these up so but they are a good airman dupe they're probably not i'm pretty sure they're not available anymore but um i have these in white and black so just kind of like adds to that whole sophisticated and just elegant and just money look so but this is the outfit i love it like it's very basic but i feel like anybody can recreate something like this you don't have to necessarily have a crochet top kind of knit top you can just have any kind of um white top with this and some um linen pants and you're good to go so but this is the perfect mom outfit like this is a mom outfit rich mom outfit personified so um but i love it you guys let me know what you think about my recreation of this particular look and we will get into the next one all right and here's the next look and i changed it out a whole lot <laughs> um i switched it up a whole lot with this outfit um because i loved the inspo pick i'll pop it up on the screen um just has on some black sunglasses a black blazer a white tee some jeans and some sambas and a little handbag so i feel like anybody can recreate that um but i just went with the outfit formula again like i said or uh, like i always say in these videos you can just go with the outfit formula and if you don't necessarily have the exact same pieces so i had those exact those exact same pieces or similar pieces but i wanted to do something a little bit different so um this is an outfit i would wear to go run errands with my kids because you know we're always running errands to go here you know here there and everywhere to go get them things whether it be things that they need for school for school projects or if you're just running errands they you know take them shopping or something um for school or just shopping in general so this is something that i will wear um so yeah so i added a hat um just because more than likely if i was to wear something like this i'm probably going to pop on a hat just because i love hats and i love to style them up so this is a burgundy hat that i just recently got from poshmark actually it's, it's brand new with tags um so it is polo ralph lauren and then to go full incognito mode <laughs> um i went with some black sunglasses these are like in this like cat eye frame um, these are from Amazon. I'm always sharing these. And then I just went with a basic necklace. I don't think I've talked a whole lot about the jewelry that I've been having on. But yeah, I just went with a necklace. Just a dainty necklace. It's a Dior necklace. So just to add a little bit more fun to the look. Um, I have on a white tee. It's from Macy's. It's actually from the men's um, department. Um, but it's really good quality. It's really nice and thick, but not too thick. So anybody can you know can wear and style up a white tee i feel like so just a plain white tee and then like i said i have a black blazer but i want to do something a little bit different a little bit more fun so i went with this checkered print or ch plaid so checkered print or plaid uh, blazer that's from mango it actually comes with some matching shorts so i just thought this would be fun like this is another sophisticated way to style up this look is just with um, a plaid blazer and it's super lightweight so i feel like i won't you know burn up when I, while i'm running errands which is why i went with this one because the black one i have um it is from zara and it's pretty thick so more than likely if we're gonna keep it you know keep it real i'm not gonna wear that <laughs> that blazer during the day i probably wear it at night but i definitely wouldn't wear it during the day to run errands so i probably wear more so something like this because it's really lightweight so um and then as far as handbag she has a black one i went with this um burgundy one just to keep with the burgundy theme of this outfit so this is from commence uh, my jeans um she has on like some distressed hem jeans i don't have any like that um so i just went with these jeans and what i did is i just did like this huge cuff i've been seeing that 
that denim trend a lot here lately just with like a huge cuff at first i thought it was crazy and ridiculous but i'm actually liking it i'm actually kind of feeling it so if you have like some extra long jeans and you don't want to cut them but you want to have like that long cuff detail or trend that's going around um then you can always just do what i just did and i just rolled it up and just did one big old cuff so i just like that i don't know you guys let me know what you think about it but um i liked it so and i did that so that i can show off my shoes um i have on my adidas sambas in the burgundy color again to go with the burgundy of this outfit and i'll also have on a burgundy belt i don't think she had a belt on but just a further just add a little bit more color you know just like a hint of color because burgundy is like equivalent to wearing a pop of red but it's more subdued so um but i love this outfit like i said i wear this to run errands with my kids and be comfortable and chic and put together and look like a like a put together mom so um but yeah i love this recreation of the look you guys let me know what you think about it and we will get into the next one all right, here's the final look and I did copy and paste with this one because I liked it too much and I had similar pieces and yeah, I just loved it. So um, she just has on a cardigan, um, a lightweight cardigan, um, looks like some linen uh, shorts, um, some Mary Jane style ballet flats and a white handbag and some like gold frame sunglasses. So I thought it looked chic and I loved it. And I knew I had some pieces similar to it. So um, this is definitely a spring outfit because I probably couldn't really wear this cardigan in the summertime. Although I probably would wear like a black tank top and maybe like drape the cardigan over my shoulders. Just like if I'm inside somewhere like at a restaurant or something, then um, I can have something to keep me a little bit warm. So um, and speaking of restaurant, um, this is probably something that I would wear again to um a restaurant with my kids like if we're going to the mall or something and we like i don't know go eat at the food court or something this is something that i would wear um i would probably wear something like this um to my son's basketball game um yeah i'd wear this to his basketball game because it's just you know simple and basic and yeah um where else probably wear this too yeah, just like hanging out with my kids. Um, even like hanging out at the house or something, I wear something like this because it's just comfortable, casual, and yeah, I love it. So, um, starting from the top, I put on these gold frame sunglasses. These are super old. I think I got them from Shein several years ago, um, but they are like in this gold frame. Um, I kept on the same Dior necklace just to keep things, you know, minimalistic. Um, I have on like a little black bandeau top that I got from Amazon because um, this is a very low V um cardigan so just to kind of keep my modesty here i went with a little bandeau top um speaking of the cardigan i think this is from h&m it's kind of thick so that's why i say in the summertime i probably couldn't really wear this um outside at least like i said i would take it with me if we're going like in a restaurant or something and then these shorts these are some limb blend shorts i think these are from dish I'm pretty sure these are from dish i got these last year from dish um and then my handbag she has a white handbag so i just want the white handbag as well typically i would go with a black one but i just went with this white one because i thought it looked better um so this is super old from ego i think it's a dupe of the Bottega one um but yeah i've had this for a while and then my shoes she has on like i said some mary jane style ballet flats so i went with these that i got from um Bavea. they gifted me these um i've worked with them before so love these these are actually my first pair of like mary jane style ballet flats so and i hardly ever wear them and they're super comfortable so i need, really need to wear these more um but yeah love this outfit it's simple i feel like anybody can pull this off even if you don't want to wear like a cardigan if you want to wear like a white button-up shirt or something or not white black button-up shirt because i do have one of those um you can also do that as well if you don't want to do a cardigan because it might be too hot um and if you don't do shorts and of course you can do some linen blend trousers so um but yeah i love this outfit love my recreation of the look like i said definitely will wear this out running errands even if i'm not with my kids i'd wear this to run errands so because it's just it's just comfortable and just easy and casual so but still looks chic and put together and classic so but yeah love this outfit you guys let me know what you think about it and that's it All right guys, so those are all the outfits. Let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite recreation. I love to know. And again, you can get inspired to wear any of these outfits or just get inspired to just wear what you, know, wear what you have in your closet. Because we're moms, does not mean we have to let ourselves go. That's one thing that I pride myself on is the fact that even though 
I'm a mom or not even even though you know I am a mom and I'm proud that I have children and you know I don't have to walk around here and look and you know let myself go just because I have children I still think that you can take time in yourself and invest in yourself and just do those small little things just to make yourself feel good because sometimes as parents especially as moms we are made to feel insignificant <laughs> and so one way to just pep you know pep our step okay and make ourselves feel better is just to put on something nice wear something nice do your hair get yourself together and you know go out here and you know conquer the world you know mom and all so um but yeah so i hope i inspired you guys you moms out there to you know live your best life girl look good doing it but yeah thank you guys so much for watching um any of the outfits that i showed you guys if any of the pieces are still available i will link them down below but again this is just inspiration so um just wear what you have in your wardrobe recreate some of these looks based on what you already have um but if anything's still available like i said like always i will link it down in the description box so but thank you guys so much for watching i hope you were inspired and i will see you guys in the next video all right bye guys